popcorn. I just got a plain jar of Orville Redenbacher popcorn. Follow the instructions on the back pretty closely. Half a cup of kernels going in there. Then we're going to do four tablespoons of oil. Go ahead and get our griddle pretty hot. We're looking at like uh, right around 400 degrees. That was just below medium. All four burners on my Camp Chef could be different for yours. So make sure you, sure you have a thermometer. Put the oil down. So I let the oil sit on the griddle for, <clears throat> mm, I don't know, 30, 30 seconds to a minute maybe. Just to uh, let the oil get hot um, and kind of really get loosened up before I put the kernels in there. Then the kernels went in to the hot oil that's on the griddle. I kept pushing it all back. I kind of wanted to get all the kernels coated up and I just wanted to get everybody, you know, oil on there, hot oil on the popcorn kernels. Make sure it's evenly spread around before I put my dome lid on top and then that's what creates kind of like the oven again. But all, now we got the kernels underneath, the popcorn kernels underneath the dome so make sure everybody gets covered spread it out thin you don't want them piled up okay you want them spread out thin put the dome on top and then this took a total of like three and a half to four minutes until you start hearing popping and this is just like the jiffy pop if you've ever done the jiffy pop on your uh, stove I mean you're just listening for it to start popping and then you want to keep shaking around so they don't burn if you leave your griddle and you just let them sit there they're gonna burn so make sure you're just moving your little dome around this would be a fun thing to do if you have kids kids old enough to be by the griddle my son's like one don't you know bring them out for the popcorn but anyways you just keep doing the uh, dome around as much as you can keep shaking it until you stop hearing it pop and then once you don't hear it pop anymore go ahead and lift it up and let's see, ooh, got ourselves some good looking popcorn there. It made a lot of popcorn, more than I thought. So, hit it up with a little salt, pepper, butter seasoning, and then some butter that I melted in the microwave. I think I will start my diet next week. Thank you so much for watching. Have a good one and keep on griddling.